Prior to Mercury, people would deploy a number of technologies in the meeting space. They might have a conference phone, they might have a USB speaker phone, they may have a large flat screen display in the room with a cable, uh, they may have a video conferencing system that's tied to one dedicated video conference like Cisco or Microsoft Skype for Business or these types of technologies. But what ends up happening in those solutions is it's a bunch of disparate experiences that don't necessarily go together and work together seamlessly for the user. So if you're actually trying to support rooms like that at scale, it becomes crazy. Before Crestron and I was working at ESPN, uh, managing conference rooms and video conferencing inside our headquarters in Bristol, Connecticut. And I was running into a lot of obstacles where we needed extensive integration and custom programming and a lot of different boxes to achieve some very simple conferencing needs. Crestron had been such a good partner that I brought it to our sales representative, my concept for what would be an ideal solution for an environment that would give me all the functionality I'm looking for, present, call, collaborate, and that also was manageable on the network and easy to deploy. So when I made the jump to come to Crestron, I spent my first few months here working collaboratively with the engineering team and with Dan Jackson to bring those concepts I had at ESPN to life in a product here at Crestron. The feature set that Mercury has was pretty much everything that Crestron was already doing. We already had wireless presentation, we had wired presentation, you know, our touch screens could already make SIP phone calls. We already had the ability to route USB and do all these other things. What we had to do was take all of these feature sets and make it into a single box that was cost effective and easy to deploy. We felt that another key piece of this was that the form had to follow the function. It had to be an attractive device. So we started down the road of having a lot of different industrial designs as concepts. And certainly we had some things that were very kind of interesting to look at, but impractical to produce or impractical for end users to try to use. We wanted something iconic, but it also needed to be sleek and low profile. And then separately, we had to be able to deliver a premium audio experience. How do you design the microphone so that they work well uh, in a room, you know, built into that device? along with a very powerful speaker, right? How do you keep the feedback from coming back into the microphones? We had to prototype all of those things. From all those iterations of testing, some of the things that we came up with were that we needed to have a unique arrangement for microphones. So we settled on a flower petal arrangement where we actually offset the microphones uh, 45 degrees from their traditional alignment so that we had clear coverage kind of rotating around the device and on the table. Given that we were able to decouple the speaker box from the main unit, we were able to use a higher quality driver than a lot of our competitors and were able to port uh, that speaker box that the driver was floating in. So it gives us a great dynamic range and the ability to produce sound far beyond what you need for a phone call. The microphone and the speaker pieces don't mean anything unless you have the ability to process the sound correctly. And for that, we leverage some of the technology in our obby at DSP. So we're able to do auto echo canceling, auto gain control, auto noise canceling, all out of the box. Honestly, it's by far the best device that exists on the market just for audio calling um, because we took so much care with that. People that I've known for 15, 20 years within the industry of unified communications looked at the product, saw its implementation, and quite frankly said, there's nothing here that you've missed. You've got audio, video, wired and wireless presentation. You've got a great form factor. You're delivering tremendous sound for in-room participants and outer room participants. And perhaps the biggest thing going is you support all video conferencing applications. We felt the right path was to support uh, bringing your own device, you know, BYOD. So effectively, you could walk in with your laptop, and no matter what call you had on whatever service it was, you'd be able to walk into that room and use that room to its fullest effectiveness to make that call. As our culture increasingly becomes, you know, mobile first, you have to provide that premium mobile experience. And so we built Bluetooth into Mercury so that you could walk into the room, whether you're on a, on a regular phone call, it could be on a Skype or business call or any other app that's out there. You can walk into Mercury and get a premium audio experience in that room on any service through your mobile device. One of the other pieces that Mercury has is a built-in occupancy sensor. And that was critical for two reasons. Number one, we want the room to be able to respond when you walk in to make it feel inviting and warm and have everything light up for the user. Uh, but on the back end, that enables us to 
understand and analyze how that room is used. Reporting back to Crestron Fusion, you can understand when the room was booked, when the room was occupied, and what devices were used in the room, and that gives you a complete picture of utilization for that space. Unlike other technologies, you've got a network-based appliance with all of the relevant security and network permissions built in so that you can install these simply and easily. You can maintain these systems via standard IT tools. You can walk into a room, place it on the table, connect it to the internet, and then through the cloud provisioning service, your administrator, wherever in the world they may be, can log in and remotely configure every single setting on the device. So it enables somebody to manage a huge number of devices across any number of geographic locations, all from one single cloud portal. It really was the first time in all of my years of experience that I'd seen all of these capabilities brought together in a very simple to use, simple to install, and simple to maintain solution set that quite frankly delivers at a price point that's never been seen before in the marketplace. Customers literally asked us, can we have this today? They've been used to using a variety of technologies, and for the first time, Crestron Mercury delivered on all the promises they needed in the meeting space.